In our health cast today, a recent study is shedding some light on how blood pressure levels can affect your brain health. Data from the study of just over a half a million people found that both low as well as high blood pressure were associated with a greater risk of dementia in men, but for women, the risk of dementia increased as blood pressure simply went up. So the idea behind treating blood pressure is not to take someone with high blood pressure and give them low blood pressure. The idea behind treating blood pressure is to take someone with high blood pressure and to bring it into the normal range. So it means that once we are treating people with high blood pressure, we do perhaps need to be more aggressive in monitoring them. So Dr. Damon Salzman is a neurologist with the Cleveland Clinic in Weston. He says researchers believe that biological differences between men and women may explain why there are these differences between the responses to blood pressure and dementia. And a new type of vaccine against the coronavirus could be coming out this summer. What's known as a protein subunit vaccine uses technology already available in other vaccines on the market. It's nothing really new, but in this case, it would be the first vaccine to actually contain the spike protein found in the actual virus rather than existing vaccines, which prompt cells in the body to make the spike protein themselves. Researchers say the new vaccine efforts are expanding, but the benefit to society won't be felt if people don't get out there and get those shots in their arms. Recent data shows vaccine rates are slowing down or even flat in many, many areas in our country. Well